welcome back to my channel. As you guys have seen by the title of today's video, I am bringing you all another home bargains haul. Honestly, I am addicted to home bargains. I do have a bag full of bits of home bargains. It isn't a home bargains bag because I'm reusing the 10,000 bags I have in my cupboards, so saving the planet and all that, you know what I mean? But I did go into home bargains today and spent for £23, it could have been worse to be honest, I'm pretty chuffed with everything I have bought and I, I wanted to make it into a haul because you guys are not always wanted me to film home bargains hauls, Primark hauls and any haul really because to be honest I really enjoy watching hauls on YouTube and it seems that like a lot of you guys like to watch them as well so that is why I'm doing it. And yes, I am now addicted to home bargains. They have their Christmas stuff out now and I am in love. So I can't wait to show you all. But before we get into this video, please make sure to leave a thumbs up. It would be nice to get to a like goal of 30 likes on this video. Also leave a comment if you are early or if you are enjoying the video so far. And without further ado, let's get on with the video. As I said before, I did actually spend £23 in home bargains. The reason why I went into town is because I do have a room in the salon. I'm pretty sure most of you guys already know this by now, but if you don't, I am a self-employed makeup artist. I am taking appointments for makeup, facial waxing, and I am also starting to do facials now. So this was pretty much an excuse to buy some kind of new skincare bits for when I do facials because I will be starting them this weekend as I am filming this video. So, I did get a few bits. Honestly, Home Bargains is amazing. Well, it's amazing for anything, but if you're looking for face masks and skincare and a few makeup bits, it's insane because they have a wide range of skincare bits and home bits and such like that. But the first thing I am going to show you is do you know how you walk into Home Bargains and they've got all the star buys well my mum actually pointed these out to me and they are gingerbread flips petrol the petrols i mean the pretzels i love these the pretzels i've never had the gingerbread flavor before i've only had the milk chocolate and the dark ones but my mum actually spied these and it was like oh these might be nice and she kindly bought them for me, so thank you very much for buying me these. I love I love gingerbread. I am pretty sure I will enjoy these. I'm guessing these are part of the Christmassy range. Um, so I'm pretty excited to have these. And I love pretzels. And I think these were... They were the one, one forty nine or something. So pretty cheap. And these are the best, the best brand of pretzels. If you ever want to try them, highly recommend. Also, yeah, my eye makeup is very deep and dark today, but I was just kind of feeling going for like a bit of like a a bold eye look. And I've got my massive eyelashes on, Tatty Lashes TL1. They're so big, but I love them. I'm obsessed with eyelashes. Anyway, and then, right, so basically, on Instagram, I follow this girl, and she goes into home bargains a lot, and she was actually raving about the new Christmas candles in Home Bargains because they're meant to be really nice and smell really nice. So, if you know me, you know that I love my candles. I actually have a Yankee candle burning in the corner there and I probably am a little bit of a candle snob at times because it's got to be like a branded candle. However, I think I've kind of swayed the Home Bargains candles a bit, guys. So, they basically had three different sizes of candles. I got this beautiful gingerbread Wigford and Co candle. This one for the big size for 2 99 And if you think a Yankee candle sell these for £24, which is a lot of money. And the smallest ones it were £39. The medium it were £59p. So this is like a big jump. But it does come in a really nice jar and a lid. But oh my god, if you guys ever go into home bargains, smell this candle. It smells like gingerbread. This scent is going to be 
in my new Christmas scent this year. I love buying candles every year because it makes me feel it makes me feel a bit more cozy and excited for Christmas. And as soon as I start burning this candle after the video, I will be feeling Christmassy, and I'll probably start doing my Christmas shopping or something probably. But it says it burns up to 95 hours, which is pretty good. But oh my god, it smells amazing. They also had other scents of these as well. I think they had a winter berries one and another scent, but this smells unreal. It, it just smells of a lovely baked gingerbread. Oh, it's honestly beautiful. Who else has an addiction to candles? Because I certainly do. It just smells. I can't get enough of this. Two ninety nine for this. It's really heavy as well. It it's good quality. It's got like a, a cute photo of gingerbread. Honestly, home bargains. You are winning at life. Honestly, I don't know what I could do about home bargains. Next up, let's have a look at what there is. Um. So for facials, I it will obviously need some headbands to kind of keep the hair out of my clients faces so I got not one not two but three headbands yeah, these were 99p each I've not actually opened these up but I I am pretty sure they are just very like a cute and pink oh my god oh my god these are so cute look look oh my god look I can't get any makeup on this. I, I probably will get makeup on it, but look at this. They're so cute. Oh my god. A 99p for these. A what a bargain. It's what I mean about home bargains. I know it's in the name. It's a bargain. But honestly, everything in there is such good quality, but such a bargain. Look. So they were 99p each. So that come to 2 dollars for three of them. Yeah, they're so soft. A really good quality for 99p. The home bargain is the place to go for stuff like that, guys. Honestly, it's way better than B&M and Poundland. Poundland's pretty crap, I think. Who else agrees with me now? Like, uh, Poundland is just... It's not uh, really feeling it for me anymore. But yeah, I'm chuffed with them. I'm sure uh, my clients are going to like wearing them as well. And for 99p, you can't go wrong. Um, then, I decided to get some things from the Bamboo range. If you guys have never seen yeah, the bamboo range in home bargains, oh my god, you need to try it out. I actually have a hairbrush from the bamboo range um, in home bargains. And honestly, it is the best hairbrush I have used. Yeah, this hairbrush, guys, it was one ninety nine. I've had this for like a while now, and I love paddle brushes for my hair. But this one in particular is such good quality. It gets all the knots out of your hair. This is part of the bamboo range, but anyway, <laughs> I decided to get three packs of their bamboo face cloths because I did originally look in Primark for their face cloths, however, they did not have any, so I was pretty good because the Primark face cloths are pretty good. But I got three packs of the face cloths, they are all made with bamboo and these were one ninety nine each, somewhat pricier, but the bamboo range is really good quality. I'll probably try and take them out if I can. It's, it's tied on by a string, but the packaging is all cardboard and stuff. It's really cool. So I've got three of these face cloths. Yeah, they're a pretty good size for taking skincare bits off. Yeah, they're lovely and soft and I am hoping uh, they will last a long time. I mean, yeah, they are made out of bamboo so hopefully yeah, they should. Isn't it crazy how uh, these are made with bamboo? Like, I thought a uh, bamboo, it was like a really tall stick. I don't know. Isn't that kind of baffling guys? Who else agrees with me? Yeah, that, yeah, how they can make uh, uh, these in, into bamboo, I do not know. It, it kind of baffled me a bit, but they are really soft and imagine these going on your face. Oh, they'll be so nice and soft, honestly. Right, and then, 
for myself, I mean, <laughs> I'm always treating myself <laughs> uh, very exciting. I decided, well, basically, in home bargains, they are selling the Crichton's, Creighton's salicylic acid, and that acid is good for basically killing spots and stuff. They're not killing spots, I mean, getting rid of spots in a way. So I decided to get the serum because I did have the serum, a cleanser, a face scrub and something else but I thought for now a serum it's pretty easy to apply you just kind of have to squirt it on your face and rub it in um, and my skin has been a bit terrible lately I don't know why I think it could be a build up of stress maybe not drinking enough water and eating too much chocolate um, so I got this, and this is one ninety nine, I believe. It's intense serum, two percent salicylic acid. The target it breakouts by helping to reduce blemishes, pores, and blackheads. I do have a lot of spots in my pores are full of blackheads. So this is what I need. Um, I'm hoping it'll work. It, it does say here, apply to face. The morning and the evening after cleansing and toning your face. Um, I am praying that this works because I, I have tried everything and I know I, I do have oily skin but I'm hoping it works. How cute is that? I will have to let you guys know because if this does help my skin I may have to buy yeah, their cleanser and stuff because a cheap skincare it can work like not all expensive skincare works on your skin it depends on skin type and what your skin likes and is used to so fingers crossed this is good I will have to let you know in one of my vlogs next up I did actually get another serum if this is going to be for my clients so this is by the brand Balance um, and it is a gold and marine collagen rejuvenating serum. So this is another serum again. The serums excite me. I don't know why. I think it's because it's like a little pipette thing, like you put it on your face. Um, and because it has the word collagen in it, I think it's like a psychological thing in your head that it's going to make your skin look younger. And it's meant to make your skin they look plumper and brighter this will be good for people who maybe have dull skin um, and it'll help with fine line and the wrinkles so here is this one yeah, the packaging is it, very nice I think I love a good serum oh my god it, it, it's actually golden glittery yeah, the only thing is if it does have glitter in it the glitter isn't meant to be in skincare products but you never know it might be a worth a try. I will be using that on clients and they did have all sort of other skincare bits but you know I didn't they won't spend too much you know. Right. Then I decided to get a simple toner because I actually need a toner and yeah, this is one ninety nine. The toners are pretty simple. They basically add the pH levels back into your skin after you have clean <coughs> Oh my god! Where did I come from? Oh my god, my eyes are watering. As I was saying, the toners basically add the pH back into your skin after you have cleansed your face. Oh my god. So, yeah. The toners are very useful. You only need a little bit, and this is alcohol free, so it won't dry the skin out. Chuffed with that. Oh my god, my throat. So weird. But then finally, I think I went a little bit overboard on the, on the face mask. However, I need to show you guys with these because I have actually tried one of these on myself and Scott. Oh my god, my skin, after it, it cleared up. I had no spots on my face for two days. It was amazing. And then two days later, 
and they all come back onto my face. Anyway, as I said, Home Bargains is the place to go for face masks. They're really affordable. They have a lot of good brands in there. They're cheaper brands, but as I said before, some of the cheaper skincare brands actually work better than expensive skincare brands. So, I grabbed four packs of the face packs, face masks. I actually have this one for myself. It's a strawberry facial scrub. However, I think I actually have the mask of this. So, I mean, it'll be pretty similar, but it'll be good for exfoliation. But I do have the face mask of this and it's amazing but yeah, these are 99p and I actually have an eye gel and a serum from face facts face facts and the wonder eye gel for your eyes actually makes your eyes look brighter I also trust the brand I've already used this on myself already and as I said unbelievable so yeah, the strawberry face scrub it'll be good for exfoliation the skin why can't I talk today exfoliating the skin I then have the regenerating the wash off a gel mask it is good for dry skin the gel masks add the hydration back into your skin and it's got a black mulberry in it so yeah, that's very good and the good thing with these is as well I've got to mention you never waste any product because did you know when you buy those face masks where you kind of rip them open and you use half the product and then like you're just wasting half of it yeah, well with these you don't have to you can just unscrew them and then you can use as much as you like really um, and then also got the firming the wash off the gel mask this is used for brightening and toning the skin so this might be better for maybe combination skin then a brightening wash off the gel mask it's used for duller skin maybe dry skin again and this has tea tree extract and also heads up these are all vegan as well so no animals were killed or tested in the making so that is very good but anyway here is the end of the home bargain haul I think I had a good a little spend I could have easily spent more but I might be able to do a Christmassy kind of home bargain haul closer to the time of Christmas if you guys would like me to or maybe buy some more home bits because home bargains haul items are insane I actually have a lot of the home items and I love them so much but if you guys have enjoyed this haul please make sure to leave a thumbs up, a comment down below and subscribe and I will see you all in my next video. Bye everybody!